Thank you all for stopping by. Uh, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel, please, if you feel like it, of course. Uh, I feel like I gave this video a solid attempt, so hopefully you all enjoy. Let me know how I did. Let me know what other kinds of videos you'll want to see in the future. And then uh, this video is probably going up on Friday, so I probably didn't upload on Wednesday. At least that's what I'm thinking because I'm recording this now on Wednesday. Uh, but just know, every now and then, I might only upload twice a week. Just depends. Life gets busy, stressful, whatever. Uh, but hopefully you'll enjoy, uh, and I'll see y'all next time. Sorry if there's any background noise in the video, but there probably shouldn't be. Sir, uh, do you need any assistance with putting your luggage up? No? Okay. Uh, is there anything else that you might need from me? Uh, the bathrooms are straight back and then just look left. In that little corridor, you should see the door for the bathrooms. Yes. My pleasure helping you. Let me know if you need anything else. Okay. Oh, hello there. Let me, let me bend over a little bit, bend down. Ah, hello there. <laughs> My name is uh, Jalen. I'll be the uh, main attendant in charge of helping you in this little section out over here today. Uh, is this your first time riding with us? It is? Well then, welcome to Relaxation Airlines, where our main goal and our main focus is to ensure that you, the passenger, have as relaxing and as pleasant of an experience as possible. And to make sure that you get your destination in a timely manner and to ensure that it is as stress-free as possible. Mm -hmm. So, since this is your first time riding with us. Uh, is there anything you'd like to ask me personally uh, regarding our services, maybe what kind of food, snacks we offer, or just generally anything you need to know? Okay, we'll go ahead and uh, lay it on me. Oh, actually, just one second, I think they're about to announce something. Hello there everyone, this is your pilot speaking. On behalf of Relaxation Airlines, I'd like to wish you all a relaxing and pleasant flight, and hope you enjoy the ride. At this time, I will need everyone to take their seats, including all flight attendants and crew on board, fasten your belts, and please prepare for takeoff. Thank you very much. Okay, so as you just heard, we're actually about to take off, so I actually need to go take my seat. Uh, but I'll be back over here in the next couple minutes uh, to hear out any of your questions. I just, quickly, I need to make sure that I'm safe and, and sitting down. But before I do go, let me actually ask, this is one of our services that we offer. Would you like some headphones? if you have your own that is perfectly fine but we do have noise canceling wireless headphones that we offer to all of our passengers in case they happen to not bring their own or would just like a different pair to use so if you've got any music maybe audiobook anything like that that you like to listen to these would be perfect to use. And they're noise canceling, so you shouldn't hear the, the engine of the plane or anything going on. So, would you like these? Very good. Well, then you can go ahead and take these. I'm going to go ahead and go sit down myself. Uh, do you need any help buckling your seatbelt? 
Yeah, you just put it in and then turn the latch over. Okay, well I'm gonna go for a quick second. I'll be back within the next five minutes. Okay, I'll be back. I'm back. Uh, how do the headphones feel? They feel fine? And now the plane shouldn't sound quite as loud. That's, that's great. And yes, you should still be able to hear me fairly well. I have uh, a little mic built in uh, so that you can hear me without having the, the background noise of the plane. So, what uh, was it that you needed to ask? Ah, of course. Can't have a good flight without your food and drink commodities. Alright, well then how about I'll just bring over a little tray of some of the drinks and snacks that we offer, and uh, I'll let you pick what you want out of there, or if you want something else, I'll just, I'll just go over everything. Okay, well let me just get that ready real quick. Excuse me, miss. Excuse me. So, go ahead and take a little look right there. Those are just a few, or really, the majority. Of the sodas that we offer as well as bottled water, of course. For anybody that prefers a simpler solution to their thirsting needs. And of course, water's great. Uh, it's healthy. Doesn't have any extra sugars or anything crazy in there uh, to affect you any differently like that. But then, of course, let's just go down the line. We have some pineapple flavored Fanta. Shariano Fanta. This is their pineapple flavor, which is surprisingly good, actually, and does taste quite similar to the fruit. So, if you want some pineapple Fanta, let me know. Of course, we have the original Coca-Cola. Now, we have these in the small cans. This is smaller than the pineapple fans I just showed you. This is more of a... Uh, It's only 90 calories per can. It's definitely a lot smaller than the Fanta and all our other drinks. This comes in the smallest portion, so if you'd like more than one of these, feel free. That's just regular Coca-Cola. And of course, we do have Diet Coke as well, if you'd like. And then of course, we have some Canada Dry ginger ale. Of course, this is good if you have maybe a stomach ache or something's not quite sitting right with you, feeling a little sick, a little off. This is definitely the drink for you. It's ginger ale, 
caffeine free. So it's not going to keep you awake. This one's definitely a good choice. And then we have some strawberry Fanta. Again, caffeine-free, as most of these are. Uh, definitely very good, very sweet. 160 calories per can. Can never go wrong with strawberry soda. And then in line with the Coca-Cola, we do also have some cherry Coke. This will be like your regular Coca-Cola with just a splash of that cherry flavor. Definitely doesn't come out super strong. Uh, it's just enough there. You can get a little taste of it. So if you'd like a cherry Coke, let me know. We also have some peach soda. Again, caffeine free. And this one definitely has a strong flavor, I would say. If you'd like some peach soda, it's a very strong peachy flavor, this one's the go-to. And then of course we do also have Sierra Mist, or if you'd like, say, hot chocolate per se, I can go make some for you. And of course we do also have some teas that I can make, or we have the bottled tea. Okay. So anything for now? Just water? Okay. And then I'll go ahead and leave this with you. I'll just lay this down here. And if you need any other drinks, feel free to let me know. So uh, next I'll go ahead and go get some of our more savory snacks. Uh, just a few. Uh, we don't offer too, too much in terms of that. But we do have a little bit of variety, so I'll show you. So again, any of these sodas, feel free to ask. Excuse me, coming through. And of course, now we've got some of our more snacky options. Uh, I'm not going to say all savory because, for one, we have things like Nutri-Grain bars here. One of my personal favorite things to snack on. It's a little sweet, but definitely not like too much. Not overbearing. It's just a light, healthy, uh, bar filled with all your grains and vitamins that you might need 
It's a good little snack to get you to get you going. And this one is blueberry flavored. I believe we also have strawberry and I think maybe like cinnamon green apple. So if you'd like one of these, one of those flavors, we got them. Now, this one's definitely a little different. As I said, we got some variety. Uh, Flamin' Hot Cheetos Puffs. A spicy chip option. Uh, they definitely pack a little kick, but since they are puffs, they're still actually light and airy when you actually eat them and chew through them. It's just to provide that little hint of spice while you're going through it. Be careful with them because if you eat them with your fingers, it will leave some of the hot Cheeto dust on your fingers. You don't want to end up accidentally touching your eyes or anything after that. Just make sure to clean your hands afterwards. Okay, so we have those. As well as regular chips. Uh, but these are personally one of my favorite flavors. Smokehouse Barbecue uh, Miss Vicky's Chips. These are definitely a good option if you want some of that salty uh, with a little bit of tang from the barbecue. And all of Miss Vicky's chips usually are more round and smaller size rather than having really big like ruffles or, or lays with large chips. These are definitely all bite size. And definitely a good option. This is just one of my favorite flavors, but of course they've got regular sea salt, cheddar, things like that too. So if you want some of these, let me know. And then last but not least, if you are looking for something uh, a little more sustainable and uh, meatier. We do also have some Jack Links. It's meat snacks, but we do have some of the jerky and other things as well. But these specifically are tender bites. So they're like little bite-sized pieces of meat. These are Teriyaki beef steak. So I'm assuming it'll have some of that teriyaki flavor. So these will definitely give you a bit more protein and some meat if that's what you're looking for. serving, they have 10 grams of protein, 70 calories, 1 gram of total fat, 0 grams of trans fat, uh, and 
four grams total carbs per serving. So if you'd like something a bit meatier and something that'll definitely uh, stick to you a bit more, that's, that's the option to go for. So would you like anything out of here? The neutral game bar? Okay. You, are you okay with the blueberry flavor? Okay. That is uh, my favorite, actually. So you go ahead and take that. Again, I'll just lay it down over here. So you enjoy that. Uh, definitely use the water to wash it down. And then uh, I'll bring out some of our sweet candy options. Yeah, the fun stuff. Okay. So let me go ahead and take this back and uh, I'll come back over in a couple minutes. Let you enjoy that first. Okay. Excuse me again. Sorry. Excuse me. So again, we have some sweeter treats and candies. So first, why don't we go over some of the, uh, the fruitier flavors and things. So first, we have some fruit snacks. Just a mixed fruit assortment of little chewy gummies. And these are extra small bags, so if you need a couple, that's perfectly fine. You can never go wrong with some fruit snacks. Definitely a classic. And then here we actually have some strawberry flavored uh, Pop Rocks. <laughs> if you wanted something that was a little more fun. and a little bit different. These are strawberry flavored and definitely fun and always a good choice. And then next we have some mini Starburst. These are miniature tiny tiny little Starbursts. You probably actually have to eat a couple of them at one time really feel fulfilled but they're nice and we have uh, strawberry cherry orange and lemon flavored inside the bag definitely very easy to share and there are enough inside that even though they're small, it should be a lot overall, if you get what I mean. So if you'd like those, they're there. Now, next we have something actually a little different, a little weird. We have these right here. I believe these are called jelly fruit jelly bites it's definitely an, uh, an interesting one I believe these have gone viral on social media actually and that's why we have them here kids definitely love them but you have to make sure you eat them the right way so they're just a bunch of little fruit uh, well, it's like a little plastic container that's filled with jello or jelly, and it's shaped like fruit, whatever that flavor is. So we have grape down here, we got some strawberry, I think green apple, orange, and pineapple is all the flavors. And just to show you, I have some of them 
the strawberry and orange right here. Uh, so the way you're supposed to eat them, I'm pretty sure, is to bite off the bottoms here or the top, but I think the bottom is a little easier. And you're supposed to just squeeze them and suck out the jello juice out of them. Uh, but the way that it went viral, I'm pretty sure, is by biting the sides of them. Uh, but that's definitely potentially messy, especially on this plane. Uh, so I'd advise not to do that. And if you're going to eat them, just bite off the bottom or the top and eat it like that. But there they are. And then there was grape, pineapple, and green apple were the other flavors. So if you want any of those flavors in jello form, these are definitely, uh, they're pretty good. And then last but not least for the fruity options, also have some nerds here. I'm sure we all know nerds. I'm pretty sure this one we have, uh, Watermelon, wild cherry, and then a uh, punch flavored. Red, white, and green. These are definitely fun to eat, and again, easy to share. For something a little more chocolatey, we do have regular Hershey's bars as well as the small little Hershey's. Oops. As well as the small little Hershey's chocolate bars. So we have the regular chocolate bars, we have the special dark chocolate bars. So these little ones are dark chocolate, these are milk chocolate. And then we also have one that I like, uh, Hershey's Crackle. And these ones are regular Hershey's bars, but they have little rice crisp inside of them. So they got that little crunch, that little pop when you bite into it. So this is probably my favorite, but if you like the regular milk chocolate or if you want dark chocolate, We've also got those ones. <clears throat> and if you'd also like, we have Kit Kat bars. I love Kit Kat bars. These ones are extra large, but they are very good. So they're just little, uh, it's like little waffle crisp that are coated in sugar and then wrapped in chocolate. So it's definitely very sweet altogether. And these ones are extra large, so it's a lot more of the waffle crisp coated in the sugar. But they're very, very good. So if you'd like these... Feel free to take them. So, out of everything I just showed you, is there anything in particular that you'd want? Nothing right now? Okay, well, if there is anything that you'd like, uh, feel free to let me know, and I'll bring that to you. Now, quickly before I go, before we get into the, the midst of the flight, into the long part of it, I just want to show you over here, if you open this up, we have pillows. <laughs> so if you need something to rest your head on and would like a pillow, we do have some big 
fluffy pillows right here. Perfect for comfort to lay behind you. Feel free to let your legs out and go ahead and take a nap, but in line with also having pillows, of course. We also have blankets. So, if you'd like a blanket to keep you warm in case you get cold, we have one right here. Very soft, very fluffy, and very good at keeping you warm, snuggled up, and cozy. So, if you need them, they'll be sitting right over there. Just reach out and grab it. It's all yours. Okay. So, feel free to take those, take a nap, uh, listen to some music, fall asleep, or listen to an audiobook. Just sit back, relax and uh, enjoy the ride. Okay. So I'll take the candy back, and if there's anything else I can get for you, let me know. Attendants, prepare for a landing, please, and cabin crew, please take your seats for landing. We should be landing in the next five minutes. Thank you very much. All right, everybody, make sure to leave in an orderly fashion, because that'll be the best to get everybody out as quickly and efficiently as possible with no problems. If anybody needs any help, let me know. Okay. So everybody just exit in orderly fashion, one at a time. Don't try to rush anything. Okay. So, how was your experience on Relaxation Airlines? That's very good to hear. Were you relaxed? Great. You look like you had a nice little rest. That's good to see. <laughs> okay, well, we've landed. Uh, it's time for everybody to go ahead and go. Uh, do you need any help taking out any of your luggage or anything? No? Okay. Oh, the headphones, yeah. Uh, feel free to go ahead and keep those. They're all yours. Sure thing. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, if you wanted to give them back, truly, you could. Uh, I mean, I guess we'd take them back, but they're yours to keep if you want them. Uh, if you need some wireless headphones, they're great. Noise canceling, and you can use them on your other flights. Or, hopefully, you'll come back to us to fly again and just bring them. Okay. Well, it was a pleasure taking care of you. And, uh, you know, you have fun out here, and uh, I'll see you maybe another time, hopefully. Okay, uh, I gotta go help other people, so...